Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Stephanie Francesca. Thank you guys for uh, stopping by and watching. To kick off my channel, um, I want to go ahead and do like a story time video. Um, let's see. So today I'm going to tell you guys the story on how I got my left eyebrow. <laughs> how I got my left eyebrow uh, chopped off. And it's actually not a weird video whatsoever. And it's actually very, very... Comment. Um, to kick off my channel, um, I'm gonna go ahead and um, give you guys a little story time video on how I got my left eyebrow chopped off at the salon. So if you wanna find out how that was gone, please keep on watching. Uh, so basically what happened was one day after work, um, I decided to go with one of my coworkers to go get some lunch and we decided to stop by this Japanese restaurant and we wanted to get sushi. We're eating lunch and everything. Everything's just fine. It's one of those weird restaurants where they're open from like 11 to like 3 and then they close for like after lunch and then they open again at 5 for dinner. I don't know. I guess I don't know if that's a, that was a thing. I guess it's a thing. Um, so yeah, we got there like around 2. So yeah, so after we finish eating and all this stuff, we're like, okay, Time to go. As we're leaving, I look at my friend and I was like, gosh, there's a nail salon, right? I need to get my eyebrows done. I haven't gotten them done forever. This one's starting to look a mess. I was like, let's just go in and, you know, let's get our eyebrows done. So we walk in and the, the man, he's like, hi, how can I help you? And I was like, hey, I just need my eyebrows waxed. Like, just need them waxed. That's it. Okay. Give me one second. I'll go get her. Okay, cool. So he runs off and he gets the woman that's supposed to come help us. And I was like, oh, hi, how are you? She's like, hey, how can I help you today? And I was like, oh, hi, um, I just need to get my eyebrows waxed. Um, and she, she looks at me and she goes, your eyebrows? Your eyebrows look fine. And I was like, yeah, but I can see some hair growing and, uh, and, and I just don't like it. I want to, can I, I just want to get them waxed. And... She's like, yeah, yeah, sure, okay. Um, so she pulls us over to the room and she starts setting me up. Okay, so I don't work at a nail salon. I, well, I don't work at a salon. Um, just from experiences, whenever I go to a salon to get my uh, eyebrows done, um, normally they'll bring you into the room. They're like, okay, lay down. Okay, lay down. So I go in, nothing. Just, okay, sit down. Okay, so I'm sitting in the chair. And I'm looking up at her and she's just getting the hot wax and she puts it on my skin and it was it wasn't even hot it was actually very cold like it wasn't hot whatsoever so I left it alone like I'm not I that's one thing about me I don't sit here and I don't complain to anyone about anything because this is your job not mine you may do things differently than I do things so you know I'm not gonna fight with you about anything because I, I don't know how you do your job so anyway, so she starts putting the wax on my eyebrows and um, she starts, you know, waxing them. And my friend is talking to her because my friend's eyebrows are very, very, very thin. And she's talking about like, you know, how she had an accident one day about someone accidentally waxing her eyebrow off and it just never grew back the same. So we're trying to convince her to get like tattooed eyebrows. And she's like, yeah, yeah, sure. Like not into it whatsoever because she's not planning on tattooing her eyebrows. So anyway, so I'm... Don't know if that distracted her, just the whole conversation, but all of a sudden, like, she waxes my left, and, like, half of it, like, this much of it was gone. And so I'm sitting here, and I don't notice, because after everything happens, she finishes my eyebrow, she tweezes, whatever, she puts the jelly on top. So when she puts the jelly on top, she kind of like flattens them. So they're kind of like, you know, they're just kind of just cooling there very, very flat. So I can't really tell. Um, and my friend, she's looking at me all weird, but she doesn't say anything. So I just, I didn't assume much of it. So I'm leaving, whatever. I say, hey, okay, thanks, paid, whatever, left. And I go home and I start washing my face because I have this jelly thing stuck on my face. And I'm like, okay. So I wash it off. <laughs> and my goodness washed off my left eyebrow and my eyebrow half of it was gone and not only that but if you actually look pretty close right there she she burned me or 
I say that she burned me with the wax. Um, like I said earlier though, the wax wasn't hot, so I don't know what happened, but this skin right here was very dark and was like, it, it seemed burned and it hurt. So nothing like she, she waxed off my eyebrow and I was, I looked, I was eyebrowless for a while. And the thing is, since it, it was burned and it hurt, I wasn't going to put any makeup over it. So I went to work every day, like with bare face, no makeup, no anything, just because I, I didn't want to touch it. Um, so I was, <laughs> so I went to work every single day and everyone laughed at me for days because I got my eyebrow chopped off. But yeah, so then after that, I just decided to go to like Sephora and get the brow definer from Anastasia Beverly Hills. I have never used a brow pencil before, but it was time to learn because I had to draw that thing back on. My goodness, it was an experience. This wasn't like a terrible story, but it's honestly the only story that I could think of and laugh about right now because it was just... Like just wax it off like okay like how do you how do you miss the hair like boop <laughs> it's a full eyebrow how but yeah so now I my hair is finally growing back um, I've got a scar to remind me of the day you know I, I've never been fond of getting my eyebrows done at the salons in the first place um, I kind of just tweeze them myself just because um, but I hate tweezing my eyebrows and I hate going to the salon to do my eyebrows so I can never win when it comes to that hence why my eyebrow got chopped off <laughs> I can't be satisfied I'm just kidding but anyways um, I know it was a very short and silly story it was probably very stupid um, no point just that my eyebrow got chopped off at the salon um, but I mean it was just a small little video to kind of introduce you guys to my channel and not just sit here and say welcome because I sat here for like 20 minutes trying to make up videos to say hi welcome to my channel but that's all I have to say hi welcome to my channel so anyways thank you guys for watching I hope you guys come back soon to see what else I have come up with um Hopefully you guys come back to see my makeup videos, fashion hauls, um, all these great things that I have planned. But I do have a lot of things planned for my channel and I hope you guys stick around to see more and uh, feel free to subscribe. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed and yeah, come back for more. I will see you guys very, very, very soon. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys.